Hello and welcome to this tutorial on the Notification Reminders feature available with JD Edwards Enterprise One Release 24. Our workplace is a busy place with a constant stream of important tasks to accomplish. Enterprise One provides a notification framework to automate the distribution of tasks in the form of messages to stakeholders and participants throughout Enterprise One. But as the days get busier, how can we keep track of all those tasks? What is most important? What is due soon? The notification reminders feature allows users to manage their notification messages by setting, resetting and clearing reminders for important tasks. Users can group and sort their messages in the message center according to reminder dates. Users can get browser pop-up messages for tasks that are almost due and even control the time interval of what almost due means. Notification designers can put a reminder on the notification itself so that all recipients have the reminder automatically set. All these capabilities add up to better visibility, control and prioritization of critical tasks, helping everyone get their job with a watchful eye on deadlines and priorities. Let's start by looking at a list of notification messages from the user's point of view. The notification list, which can be opened with the bell icon, on the Enterprise One taskbar provides a simple list of notification messages with the most recent messages at the top. But the most recent message isn't necessarily the most important one and it's probably not the one that is due next. New reminder icon on the right provides immediate visualization of which messages are due sometime in the future, due soon which means within the next 24 hours, already past due. There might also be notification messages for which a reminder is not yet set, indicated by a clear flag. The user can easily click any flag and reset the reminder date, even to a specific custom date and time. Notification reminder can also alert the user to tasks that are almost due, for example within the next 15 minutes. By clicking the bell icon in the bottom status bar, the user is presented with a pop-up to configure the time interval the system checks for upcoming tasks. If the user has enabled browser pop-ups, he will get a browser pop-up reminder indicating that some tasks are almost due within the time interval he has set. While the notification list provides a quick sequential view of the most recent notifications, it needs some help when it comes to managing a large number of notifications. That's where the message center comes in. The message center allows user to group, sort, and filter their messages on a number of criteria such as the subscription name, the subject, or the notification date. And yes, as you would expect, with the notification reminders feature, users can now sort and group their messages based on the reminder date. Want to see all messages sorted by reminder date? Just choose sorted by reminder date. Want to see messages in groups? What's due today, tomorrow, next week? Just click the show in group option. Message center gives users a lot of control over how they view, sort and group their messages. And now with grouping and sorting by reminder date, they can always see what's the most urgent task to focus on. But what about those designers, team leaders or system administrators who create the notifications in the first place. Are there reminder capabilities for them too? Of course. The notification designer now has the ability to define the reminder right on the notification itself. When the subscribers receive the notification message, it will be preset with the reminder date that reflects the urgency of the task. Notification designers indicate that the notification will have a reminder simply by clicking a switch. That switch opens a pop-up in which the designer can specify the reminder date. But it's not a rudimentary hard-coded date. It's more sophisticated than that. The designer can choose to set the reminder date based on a simple rule such as a number of hours, days, weeks or months from the time the notification was sent. And that number itself can be a literal number or a variable. Alternatively, the designer can set the reminder date based on a variable that is passed into the notification at runtime. That input date 
might come from a system that is triggering the notification or it might come from an orchestration. For example, an orchestration that passes in a promised delivery date. The capabilities are very powerful and the notification designer is in control. Now that you have seen an overview of the capabilities of notification reminders, let's build a notification with a reminder to check on the latest JD AdWords Enterprise One enhancements on Learn JD. First, sign on to Orchestration Studio and click Notifications. Click New to create a new notification. In the Name field, type JD AdWords Enhancements. In the Description field, type Quarterly Reminder to check the latest JD AdWords Enterprise One enhancements. Click Save. Click the triangle to expand the message section. Click the triangle to expand the action section. Click the add button next to other links. In the other link ID box, enter learn JDE and click apply. In the type drop down, select URL. In the URL field, type www.learnjde.com. In the link text box, type learn JDE. Click save. Scroll up to the message center. In the subject box, type quarterly reminder, check on JDE enhancements. In the box, type this is your quarterly reminder to check the Learn JDE website for the latest JDE AdWords Enterprise One enhancement. Click here to go to. With the cursor at the end of the line, from the placeholder dropdown, choose learnjde.link to insert the link to the Learn JDE website. You could also add similar URLs like the Learn JDE announcements coming soon and product catalog pages. Click Save. Now that you have created a notification, it's time to add the reminder. Click the reminder icon at the right side of the message bar. A pop-up appears allowing you to configure your reminder. Click the Enable Reminder switch to turn it on. For this notification, we will use a date rule. The reminder will be set for the number of days from the day that the notification is delivered. Click the literal switch to turn it on. Choose a number and a unit of time to set the notification. For this tutorial, we can use the default of 3 days. Click close. Click save. Now that you have created the notification, we need to subscribe to it. Sign on to the Enterprise One web client from the Tools drop-down. Choose JD AdWords Enterprise One. From your User ID drop-down, click Manage Notifications, then My Subscriptions. On the My Subscriptions page, click Add Subscriptions. Choose the JD AdWords Enhancements notification that you created in the previous step. Click Save. Click Cancel to close the My Subscription page. Now that you have subscribed to the notification, we can run it. Return to the Orchestrator Studio and the notification that you created. Click the Test button. Turn on the Dispatch Notification switch. Click Execute. Close the Success Message box. Now that you have sent the notification, we can go back to the Enterprise One web client and view it. Notice that you have a new notification in the notification list. Quarterly reminder. Check on JD AdWords enhancements. Notice also that the notification has a reminder on it. Hover over the flag to see the reminder date. Click the notification to open it. The notification reminders feature adds a couple of new elements to the notification message the reminder timestamp and the reminder flag. Click on the reminder flag. This is how you can choose to reset the reminder date on the message. Click custom to choose any date and time you wish. And as we mentioned before, when you view the notification message in message center, you can filter, sort and group your messages according to the reminder date. So, from this brief tutorial, we hope that you have some great ideas about how to put notification reminders into practice at your enterprise. Indeed, 
Our workplace is a busy place, but with the JD Adverse Enterprise One digital platform and features like notification reminders, all these capabilities add up to better visibility, control, and prioritization of critical tasks, helping everyone get their job with a watchful eye on deadlines and priorities. Thanks for watching.